Okay, so question 12 asks, why are the electronegativity values of noble gases zero? So first, let's recall the definition of electronegativity. So electronegativity is the tendency of the atom to attract electrons. So if we think about all the noble gases, they are inert, meaning they don't easily react with things in the atmosphere. And the main reason for this is because they don't, they have a full octet already. So let's say I had argon. If I were to draw out its electron dot diagram, it has a full octet. So it doesn't need to gain any more electrons. And it's pretty stable the way that it is. But let's say we had Chlorine. Chlorine has only seven valence electrons. So it really wants to gain another one in order to gain a full octet. So therefore, we can say that chlorine is very electronegative. And that's because it really wants to gain that extra electron to end up having a full octet, just like all the noble gases. Okay, so the junior tutor said, Actual, the electronegativity of noble gases is zero because these elements don't normally form compounds. This was observed by Linus Pauling when he created the Pauling scale, didn't put any values on for the noble gases. Yeah, so this solution is correct. Okay, so the solution